वेलकम फ्रेंड्स दिस इज क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री ऑफ एक्सरसाइज फोर्टीन पॉइंट टू इन दिस क्वेश्चन वी हैव टू फाइंड मीन एंड मोड ऑफ द डेटा गिवन इन दिस टेबल इन दिस टेबल दे आर टू कॉलम फर्स्ट कॉलम इज एक्सपेंचर इन आर एस एंड सेकेंड कॉलम इज नंबर ऑफ फैमिली विच इज आवर एफ आई अकॉर्डिंग टू क्वेश्चन द नंबर ऑफ फैमिलीज इज टू हंड्रेड सो समेशन ऑफ एफ आई इज इक्वल टू टू हंड्रेड नाउ वी हैव टू फाइंड मोड एंड मीन ऑफ दिस डेटा लेट्स फाइंड द सोल्यूशन वी नो डेट मोड इज कल टू एल प्लस एफ वन माइनस एफ नॉट डिवाइडेड बाई टू एफ वन माइनस एफ नॉट माइनस एफ टू इन टू एच नाउ वी कैन सी इन दिस टेबल द मैक्सिमम फ्रीक्वेंसी इज फोर्टी सो दिस इज एफ वन एंड द क्लास कॉरेस्पॉन्डिंग टू इट इज आवर मॉडल क्लास नाउ वी हैव टू फाइंड एफ नॉट एफ नॉट इज द फ्रीक्वेंसी ऑफ डेट इंटरवल विच कम्स बिफोर द मॉडल क्लास वी कैन सी इन दिस टेबल That the interval 1000 to 1500 comes before the model class, so 24 is f naught. Now we have to find f2. F2 is the frequency of that interval which comes after the model class interval. So we can see in this table that 2000 to 2500 interval comes after the model class interval, and its corresponding frequency is 33. So f2 is 33. Now we have to find h. H is our class size of interval. We can see H is equal to upper limit of any interval minus lower limit of any interval equal to 500. We can see H is same in all interval. Now F naught is 24. F1 is 44. F2 is equal to 33. Model class is equal to. H is equal to 500. L is equal to. We know that L is the lower limit of model class. You can see here lower limit is 1500. So L is equal to 1500. Now substitute these value into the formula of mode. Mode is equal to 1500 plus F1 minus F0 divided by 2F1 minus F naught minus F two into H fifteen hundred plus twenty upon eighty eight minus fifty seven into five hundred sixteen upon eighty eight minus fifty seven into five hundred is equal to fifteen hundred plus three four seven point eight three is equal to one eight Four seven point eight three. Hence, our mode is one eight four seven point eight three. Now we have to calculate mean. For calculating mean, we have to find x i. We know that x i is equal to upper limit of any interval plus lower limit of any interval upon two. Now we have to find x i of first interval. So x one is equal to upper limit of first interval plus lower limit of first interval. Similarly, x2 is 1750, x3 is 2250, x4 is 2750, x5 is 3250, x6 is 3750, x7 is 4250, or x8 is 4750. Now we have to find di. We know that di is equal to x i minus a. This is the general formula for calculating di. By the help of this formula, we can calculate all of di. So d1 is equal to d1 means di of first interval x1 minus a, where a is our assumed mean. Now we have to find the value of a. We know that the value of a is the middle term of our x i. Our x i is r. We can see there are eight term. So this is a even number. So we have two a. We can choose a is equal to two seven five zero or a is equal to three two five zero. It is our choice. Here I am choosing a is equal to three two five zero. Now d one is equal to x one minus a equal to one two five zero minus three two five zero equal to minus two thousand. Similarly, d two is x two minus a equal to one seven five zero minus Three two five zero minus fifteen hundred. Similarly, D three is minus one thousand. 
d4 is minus 500 d5 is 0 d6 is 500 d7 is 1000 and d8 is now we have to calculate ui we know that ui is equal to di upon h so u1 is equal to d1 upon h is equal to minus 2000 upon 500 minus 4 u2 is equal to minus 3 u3 is equal to minus 2 u4 is equal to minus 1 u5 is equal to 0 u6 is equal to 1 u7 is equal to 2 and u8 is equal to 3 now for calculating mean we have to find the product of ui and fi and put these value in, into the table let's draw a table in this table there are four columns first column is expenditure in rupees second column is number of families which is our fi third column is ui and fourth column is the product of ui and fi we can see in the first row 24 into minus 4 is equal to minus 96 similarly 40 into minus 3 is equal to minus 120 similarly you can find rest term of fi ui and here is the sum of each term of fi ui this is also called summation of fi ui summation of fi ui means the sum of all term of fi ui minus 96 plus minus 120 plus minus 66 plus minus 28 plus 0 plus 22 plus 32 plus 21 is equal to minus 235. Similarly, according to question, summation of fi means the sum of all term of fi means 24 plus 44 plus 40 plus 33 plus 28 plus 30 plus 22 plus 16 plus 7 is equal to 200. Now we know that mean is equal to A plus summation of ui fi divided upon summation of fi into h is equal to 3250 plus minus 235 divided by 200 into 500. 3250 minus 587.5 is equal to 2662.5 hence required mean is 2662.5 so mode is 1847.8 and mean is 2662.5